Hello guys, so welcome to the part 2 of our energy saver editing tutorial. So in this part 2 we'll learn some few things like the reflection effects, the distortion and the shake effect as well. So we ride on as we add on our adjustment layer and then trim it to fit the position you want to add your saber effect. And then after we're done we go ahead and add our saber effect. And now you can outline the position you want to add your saber effect. Now we finally go ahead and track the energy ball using keyframe. So we as well duplicate the energy saber effect to increase the glow opacity. So let's proceed forward as we add on another adjustment layer and follow the same process. So we proceed forward as we add on our distortion effects over here. So we apply the tracker on the distortion effects to track the energy effects along with it. So in order to add on reflection, we go ahead and add on the solid shape and select preferred color. And after that, we go to blend and select overlay. So we click on the shape type and select pen tune. So we map on the area we want the reflection to reflect on. And 
after that we go to blend and eliminate the startup of the reflection using keyframe. So we've come to the end of this video, so thank you all very much for watching, see you on our next tutorial, peace out.